This on ventral side also these are very visible. These dots are nothing but uh, these are actually openings of ampulla pleurangina. Okay, sensory organ. And you can see cartilage here, nostrils, jaw, lower jaw, upper jaw. This is eyes and five gill slits. One, two, three, four, and five. Five gill slits. Pectoral fin, pelvic fin. If it is male, Clasper. pelvic fin also have two extension called as claspers. And this is cloaca. Here, this is a cloaca. This part is called as cloaca. This is a common place for urinary genital system and digestive system. Urinary genital may excretion be agya or genital be agya. This is ventral, which is known as also anal fin because it is close to anus. This is caudal fin which is also known as tail fin. Tail fin is divided into two. It is called as ventral lobe and this is dorsal lobe. These are unequal and asymmetric so it is known as heterocircle type of tail. Dorsal fins are two. Anterior dorsal fin and posterior dorsal fin. You will find this. These are having little tip here. Not spine. There is no spine here. It is soft and uh, this will uh, also have particular shape in each species. Different species will show different types of uh, and dependent on this shape you come across, uh, you can identify shark because shark keep their dorsal, first dorsal fin above water surface when they are sitting. Now if you look at, this is dark, this is light because when you look shark from top it is matching with the uh, background of the water. Water is darker from top. When you look this shark from lower side, you are looking from, if you are dying below this, then you are looking towards sky. Because of that, this light color will match with the background, lighter color. That is the adaptation in these fishes that will show two colors. And this is found only in pelagic fish. Pelagic fish, surface to the past your idea. Deep sea fishes will not have this type of coloration. Top may dark, light may be hiding. So, Jobi fish up to do color may be hiding, some do pelagic. Now we know this is the opening of the system called as mouth. Mouth is start to make the dietary system. Diet is so present again. Well, a mouth, it is crescentic open, crescentic mouth. And ventrally open, ventral mouth, crescentic mouth. Hmm. इसको बोलते हैं crescentic mouth. और इसे इसके बाद यहाँ buccal cavity. पहले mouth cavity को बोलते हैं buccal cavity. And after that buccal cavity, you will find inside there is a clumsy tongue. Pharynx. Pharynx is perforated by this gills. This is the area where pharynx is present. Okay, one. So it leads to into digestive system. So we can go. Getting that? So there is no say any barrier here. It directly opens. And shark keeps his mouth open and swims. And then water enters here and it comes out from the gills. And because of that, it has to continuously swim. It has no upper column or no any process which will angle water. They can't angle water. They have to just swim to pass their water to these gills which are present inside it, the gills. And then respiration, otherwise they will die if they stop. So while sleeping also shark will swing. They will slip, but while sleeping also they will go on moving forward.